I'm Derek Smith, a hand and upper extremity surgeon, primarily focusing on issues from the elbow distal. That's the elbow, forearm, wrist, and hand at Flagstaff Bone and Joint. If we go back a ways, I, I'm originally from Southern California. Uh, after uh, finishing high school, I went to the Naval Academy and was served on active duty in the United States Navy for six years. Uh, they sent me to graduate school for a master's degree in physics. Went through a nuclear power school, uh, serving on an aircraft carrier, working in the reactor department. And then I transitioned away from the military and uh, went to medical school. That I did as a civilian, and I've, I've been working uh, in private practice ever since I, I graduated medical school and finished my uh, training. Went to medical school at Columbia University in New York City. Uh, went to uh, through a uh, residency in orthopedic surgery in Portland, Oregon. Uh, did specialized training in hand surgery and microsurgery uh, during a hand fellowship in Cincinnati, Ohio, and then transitioned to private practice for several years in Central Oregon before moving to Flagstaff, moving with my family to, to Flagstaff to join the group at Flagstaff Bone and Joint. So why did I subspecialize in hand surgery? This is sort of a funny response, but I really like the variety that I, I um, variety of ailments that I see in hand surgery. I know it's a small geographic or anatomic area, but I get to take care of conditions that involve a variety of different tissue types and require a variety of different techniques. I can take care of tendon, ligament, bone, nerve, blood vessel issues uh, that encompass a variety of different locations, ranging from the elbow down to the fingertips. I'd like to think my approach to patient care involves being a doctor first, uh, really focusing on listening to the patient, meeting them where they are, and then coming up with our treatment plan. And I, I focus on conservative treatments that don't entail surgery when it's feasible, uh, but when surgery is appropriate, when patients have issues that are more urgent, uh, then, then I don't hesitate to provide them with an operation that, uh, that I feel will benefit them. That requires a careful conversation to build trust, to build rapport, and to make sure that the patient understands the uh, the relationship we're, we're developing uh, and, and understands that there's a recovery process that is required with surgery as well. What I really find rewarding about my job is, is seeing patients recover and return to most of their activities. I really feel like I lucked out joining the Flagstaff Bone and Joint community. Uh, the group here is, is absolutely wonderful. We have a variety of different physicians, physician assistants, and staff who really are helpful in taking care of patients in, in a way that mirrors the way I would want to be treated if I was a patient. Um, folks work hard, they play hard, and they get along really well. And I'm, I feel very fortunate to have joined a work community that has the same values I have. At the same time, I'm really also fortunate to have joined uh, a greater community in Flagstaff that um, has a lot to offer. My family and I enjoy doing quite a few different outdoor activities, uh, skiing, snowboarding, uh, camping, things that uh, I think sometimes we take advantage one can take advantage of, but one take for granted in communities like this that have such an abundance of, of special things we can do outdoors. I, I hope to impact the lives of my patients by allowing them or facilitating their being able to get back to the things that are important in their lives. Mm -hmm.